Hi everybody, it's Jojo, and I'm here to do a fragrance review on the new Dream Bright by Bath & Body Works. This is the mini perfume spray. They only have it in a perfume spray right now, um, and maybe a single wick candle. The full collection doesn't come out for another week or so. It's called Dream Bright, and it has the fragrance mist and all the other packaging has these beautiful shiny diamonds on it. I mean, you guys, do you see that? It's just the packaging alone is my favorite. I love anything shiny like this. This is called Dream Bright. So the keynotes, I have it all over my, have it all over myself right now. It's so good. Ugh. So the keynotes is um, berries, night blooming orchid, and vanilla. So let me just respray this. I think it's strong enough. I don't think this is gonna last you all day, but I think it will last you for a few good hours. Okay, at first, yeah, you definitely get the berries. I think it's like red berries, that's what I'm getting. I don't think it's blueberry, raspberry, or strawberry. I think it's just like a red berry, a typical red berry note. And I think um, it's definitely florally with the orchid. It's very fruity and floral. Um, it's not too florally, it's more fruity than floral, but the floral is definitely there. And I do get the vanilla. So the vanilla is making the floral note and the berry note very sweet. And I like that. Listen, this is not anything earth shattering. It's not. Um, this, I don't think it's a complete repackage of anything. However, I don't think it is something new. I think that it's very similar to other fragrances that Beth and Bottom stuff have done. Um, a few I can name Into the Night. Into the Night may be a little more deeper than this. I feel like... It's definitely in the family of like um, a thousand wishes. It's kind of like, yeah, it's kind of like a florally sweet notes scent. It doesn't smell like a thousand wishes, but it's definitely in the same family. You know, it's similar, but it's, I love it. I don't know, I, I, I love this. I love this. This is the perfume spray, but I really like this. I'm definitely getting the shower gel, maybe the cream. I'm loving this, guys. I think it's really good. I don't think it's that strong. That's the only downside to this. I don't think it's that strong. I think it will definitely um, die out and fade out in a few hours. So you definitely would need to put this in your pocketbook and refresh yourself throughout the day. But I like it. I like it. Um, I think it's definitely... I feel like it's more like daytime. Daytime, spring summer scent. I don't think they should have brought this out for the winter. I think this is more daytime for spring and maybe even summer. Very daytime. The packaging throws you off because the packaging is, it looks like it's going to be a nighttime fragrance. You know what I mean? Like it just, it just makes you think of like, it's dark blue. You think of nighttime. No, it's, it's very light. It's very fruity, sweet. Um, not too sweet, but more fruity than anything. And I do think that, um, it's, it, they should have brought this out for, um, spring. Maybe with different packaging, you know. I like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Yeah. I recommend it. Definitely try it. I like it a lot. Fall and Bloom. I don't know. I, I'm kind of battling with these two because the two, these are the two new signature scents, Fall and Bloom and this. I haven't liked the signature scent in a very long time. Fall and Bloom and this one, I like neck and neck. I think I like Fall and Bloom a little bit more only because it's a little more unique. Fall and Bloom is like a unique scent. It's definitely nothing like they've ever done. Very different, very good, but very different. This is very similar to things they've done before. So, and I do think Fall and Bloom is stronger and this is a little more lighter. It's great. I like it though. I like it. And this is only $8. Um, it's normally, I think, $14.50, but it was on sale for eight something. It's great, it's a steal. All right, I love you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this same review of the new Dream Bright coming to Bath & Body Works in a week or so, very soon. All right, so I love you guys. Bye.